Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. We decided to uh, come back and start filming and she is in a very content mood so I decided to grab her uh, so we could start my, the introduction of this video this way with the little cat. So I hope you don't mind that. How is everybody? I hope you missed me last week. We had our federal election uh, last Monday so i've been busy with that and no time to film and post and that's it so we're back and um i find it a little bit difficult to have some time to do some videos right now and post them but um what i'm going to do is talk about something i've been dying to talk about all summer i talked about it a little bit and and I talked about um, doing some swatches of different type of tinted sunscreens. And I've decided what I really, really love and I'm going to use throughout the winter to see how my skin handles it because in the winter my skin is more dry and I think there is a, a bit of alcohol in the sunscreen and I'm talking about the color science. So I've been talking about this, I reviewed it. This is not the tinted version, but it is a little bit peachy. And I really, 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 really love this. And there was something else that I ordered and then I ordered some more sunscreen and they came in separately and um, one of the products that I got was came in very, very late. Actually, this is a refill. So the last video I did, I, it's in my empties and I'm done with it. This is the new order that I was hoping to get by the um, beginning of August or mid-August. And I didn't get it because I wanted to do a swatch of a, another Color Science brand. But this is a body version. And I don't think I've ever showed this to you on my channel. Um, I was waiting to get some refills and then talk about it. This is a body sunscreen from Color Science, and it's an SPF 15. It's called the Body Shield, and you have to shake it really good. I found every time I shook it, it was quite thick, but the first time I got it, I, you could tell that it was a good thing that I, I shook this tube of sunscreen and if you can see it this is what it looks like it feels extremely silky very very silky i it's just really beautiful and once it's in it doesn't rub off on your clothes especially if you're wearing white clothes so i really like this and sorry for the lighting here it's super sunny this afternoon and it looks like it's a beautiful weather and this is the only time that I have to film. So um, I highly recommend this product and apparently it's water resistant only for so long and you have to uh, keep on reapplying it. It has zinc oxide of 12%. So it is a mineral sunscreen and um, I'm really loving this and I'll definitely be ordering this in the spring to be ready for the summer season. And I've already mentioned this one in my past YouTube videos. It is a Sun Forgettable Enviro Screen Protection Face Shield in SPF 50. But I finally, finally was able to get my hands on this product, Color Science Sun Forgettable Face Shield called Flex. Face Shield Flex SPF 50, if I remember correctly and i have been using this in fact i got a sample the last time i got a refill of this one and i didn't think it was a large sample because it was just a tiny little packet let me grab it for you and i'll show you so i saved a little sample package that i received because i really wanted to film a video and this was not being sold in canada uh, when i received this but i gave it a try and I thought of filming a video showing that myself applied on and show my initial reaction. Um, but I didn't have time for it because I decided to do it first thing in the morning before I went to work. So this is a tiny little sample and it shows that you get 0.03 ounce. 
so one millimeter and I put all of this on my face all of it I actually when I squirted it out I was surprised it was quite a bit in there and then I put it down my neck and it comes out super super white and then I kind of massaged it in it feels slightly thick and I thought it felt a little bit heavy and I didn't know what to make of it but I felt also with the heaviness that I was getting excellent coverage so um, it doesn't give me the number of SPF on this so I'm not too sure it says dispens on fingertips rub gently to activate pigments so this is a tinted sunscreen I got the lightest shade what was the point for myself to get medium or dark shade when I'm fair skin I don't see the point it is beneficial with majority of the sunscreens that are out in the market especially the ones at the drugstore that you know it blends into my skin color and it's not so bad um, but this one doesn't indicate if it's an SPF 50 so um, that's a little surprise I don't know if the American version indicates that it's American um, SPF 50 but you do need to shake this really good and it's not as runny as the first version that came out this one is very liquidy and there's a ball in it where this one I don't sense that there's a little bit of a ball in it you can't hear anything and the cap um, packaging is in a different color so you can tell the difference I use this typically every day I'm because I have to go to the office I'm still suffering from breakouts and I was very ill so I'm sure I got a little bit stressed out about that but it is called flex and this uh, selection I made I got is for fair skin and let me put a little bit on my hand so you can see what it looks like there you go and I am decided to use this uh, occasionally during the week when I'm going to the office to wear it uh, for foundation it's very very white as you can see and I'm sure other people have posted videos in the United States because they got this product first and you just keep on blending and blending and it feels silking smooth just like the body one uh, the body version this one the bigger one right over here it's um, four ounces 120 milliliters it feels a little bit thicker than the first version that came out so um, this one's really runny this one feels thicker but very silky and uh, the flex version that I just put on my hand blended in and that is it and I have it on my skin right now so this is what it looks like and I'm going to do another video on this product I revealed it I got it as a gift from a dear friend of mine and I have it on my eyes right now and I'm really loving it and um, I did this whole eye application just with one brush and my finger so I'm gonna do a video on how I applied this on I'm wearing no eyeliner just mascara no false lashes and um, that's what I've got on right now so I've been experimenting with these shades so I'll do another video to show you what um, what it's like to apply it on my skin or the eyelid skin is very dry at night my uh, cat likes to lick my eyelids just at the tip of her tongue and I find it dries out my eyelids uh, quite fast so that's that so I hope you really enjoyed this video I am wearing um, the t-shirt that I got from Walmart if you remember my last I think it was my last Walmart haul and to be honest with you I don't even feel like shopping uh, for clothes at Walmart I find the style selection isn't as good but this is a great t-shirt it feels soft and comfortable the other ones that I got um, it, it wears out a lot quicker and it looks like rags so I just wear it indoors at home so you might catch me wear it uh, when I film a video and 
This uh, is from Goriana. I think that's how you pronounce it, not Gorajana. I'm not too sure. And it's the uh, gold with um, rhinestone silver um, bar here. And this one is from Jenny Bird. And my uh, ring here is from Sororski t-shirt and I'm wearing blue jeans and you can't see right there and I can't back up any further but that's everything that I'm wearing right now and for my lips let me quickly show you what I'm wearing on my lips it is sort of like a peachy shade and I talked about this before from my Nordstrom sale this sold out very very quickly this is it um, it's sort of like a peachy shade. I like it and I find it very moisturizing and then this one also uh, Came in the kit very pretty packaging Sorry, I should raise that over there and that's everything. So I hope you enjoyed this and I will be back probably to Reveal what's in my beauty trash and I'll see you re real soon. Take care. Bye